Hey students, Professor Walters here, and I wanted to let you know that there will be a confidence exam this semester for all four of the exams. They will be held within a day or two after the normal exam. Don't worry, you'll still be able to drop one of your four exams. It's okay, you don't have to do all four and the conflicts. No, no, no. Don't worry about that. Um, I just want to give you some heads up about the conflicts. They will be announced on Compass, and you will be signing into Compass to do them uh, to avoid cheating because the multiple choice exam and stuff like that. The uh, conflict exam are essays. There will be five to six essay questions. Each one will be you know, a different level of difficulty. Um, this is what I've done for the last nine years teaching the class. The conflict has always been essays. The grades have been the same or similar, like 91% versus 91.5%, so no real big difference there. But I want you to know that we will have one because with 1,100 students, Obviously, there are some conflicts out there and some other professors aren't as um, accommodating. So I want to make sure that our students do have something. Um, so there is that. You do not need to sign up for the conflict exam. With 1,100 students, I trust you. Maybe you overslept. Maybe you're hungover. Maybe you have another class. That's all fine excuses to me if you need to take the conflict, okay? Now, for those of you that are going to take that don't want to do the conflict, don't want to do the essay, you're like, Mark, but it's just the timing doesn't work so well. So I'm going to expand the hours for all four of the exams. Instead of being from uh, 8 p.m. to 11 p.m. champagne time, they'll be from 5 p.m. to 11 p.m. champagne time. So people have a wider like range they could do the exam if they want to do the multiple choice. If you don't, don't do the conflict. If you don't remember, you can drop one. It's no big deal. Um, but you can't do like the multiple choice and go, I don't like that grade. I want to do something else. No, I will only take the multiple choice exam uh, as your as your grade. Um, I won't take both. Okay, so have a heads up for that. Uh, so for those of you that need to take the conflict exam, um, it will be showing up on the Compass homepage, just like the normal exam will. Okay, so you're going to show up on there. Um, I, but I will send out the announcement of what time it's going to be and what day because it'll be like that for each exam. Okay, so we'll have it all set up. But I want to let you all know, do I have any other notes to make sure I tell people? Nope, we'll post times, extra time for every five to six essay questions. You know, kind of like, you know, hey, uh, do the key success factors for the soda industry or something like that. Like, and you have to do it and you have to explain it and stuff like that. If you're looking for essay questions at the end of some of the chapters or some kind of essay type questions at the end, you can look at those. Um, but it's really based on the same stuff we're covering in the videos and the book, so you'll be fine. And also with the essay ones, you can use the books and videos too, so that's not a problem. Um, so I hope that helps. And for those of you the conflict, uh, there you go. You have one. Um, uh, but you still have plenty of time if you have other classes and exams with a from five to six. That's a six hour window. You, you don't have stuff that long. So uh, I wish you all the best. Good luck on the exams, whichever one you're going to take. And again, hangover, tired, just want to do an essay instead of the multiple choice. It's all okay. And yes, if you have another exam at the same time, you could take the conflict too. You don't need to ask me. It's totally fine. Wish you all the best. And I'll say bye from here in beautiful Idaho.